guys i'm back with more reviews this is my bingo book if you're an anime fan especially naruto you will, this will click ah you get it bingo book so this is where i keep all my fantastic ideas when i get them in the middle of the night any time of day jot them down don't lose your ideas anyway today i'm interviewing uh, not interviewing today i am reviewing squid game as I always say, my reviews are very short, to the point. The point is, is it worth watching or is it not worth watching? Obviously, you can answer that for yourselves. It's worth watching. Fantastic story, fantastic concept. I mean, this concept is not so new though. I mean, if you're a film geek like me, you'll, you've watched so many movies from the time you were a kid. You'd get to understand that there are some movies which may have, or, or series, not even series, movies that may not have been as popular in the past when they were released as Squid Game is, that had the similar concept. Like there was a film, I think 2001 or 2003 called Battle Royale. It had a similar concept, a Japanese uh, indie film, where you have this kind of death game and uh, the stakes are your life, you know what I mean? So at, at the end of the day, Squid Game, people watched it who may not have watched things like that, or Battle Royale, would be like, wow, this concept is so original, it's so good. It was in its own right, because they didn't do what we saw in these other films, in all these other franchises. And that's what made it special. The cast was fantastic, the acting was exemplary, this ensemble. There was no point when you're watching Squid Game. I think you've watched my other review just Brief, uh, previously, previous to this about Resident Evil. I know those are two completely different genres. Now the thing is, the difference between Resident Evil, if you've seen my short review, and Squid Game, is that with Squid Game at no point are you uh, feeling like it's draggy. Like you want the story to keep moving, you are always engaged. If anything, you feel like you want to put brakes on it and you wish that you had more episodes to it so that you don't finish it. You know what I mean? So like, it's binge-worthy. If anything is binge-worthy, and you see an episode of Squid Game is like 15 minutes, an episode of these other shows we watch mostly are between 45, maybe 35 to 40, 42 minutes. Squid Game, you get some episodes close to an hour, and that's very common with these South Korean indie series. But at no point do you feel like you're watching something for an hour because you're so engaged, they, they keep the momentum high and they keep the momentum going. So I think that's it. Is it worth watching? Yes. What's my rating? I give it a strong 8 over 10. I know most people will say, oh, Squid Game is a 10 over 10, 9 over 10. For me, I never give 10. Only God can make a movie or a series that is 10 over 10 or a video game or a music record. I never rate anything 10 because we human beings are never perfect. So if I give something a 9, that's, th that's perfect in human standards. So Squid Game for me is an 8. I gave Avatar, uh, I think I gave Avatar a 9. And, and Avatar is like a masterclass of f a fantasy filmmaking. So anyway, if you have not watched Squid, Ga Squid Game, please do watch it. I hope they, the sequel I know is, is in production. I, I wish they did not because some things don't deserve a sequel. Not deserve, they don't warrant a sequel. I feel that spoils it. But anyway, peace. <laughs> Game of Thrones, I'm going to